Unit Two, Recording Five. We need to discuss how we're going to keep everyone informed about the potential takeover of the company by Binds PLC. Firstly, I think we should send a letter to all employees about the situation, guaranteeing that no jobs will be lost if Binds takes over. Why don't you meet the staff and explain it face to face first? I think they'd appreciate that. Yes. But not yet. Email all staff inviting them to a meeting on Friday fifteenth in the staff room. I'll tell them then. I'll email them straight after this meeting. We can send them a letter with all the details after we've told them face to face. Okay, good idea. And what about our customers? We don't want them to hear about this from the newspapers. Shouldn't we let them know that it's business as usual? Yes, I agree. We can do that after we've signed the contract on Wednesday twentieth. How do you think they'll respond? I think they'll be concerned about quality. Binds are not known for their quality and customer service as we are. They'll still get the best customer service we've always offered, and we'll make sure the quality doesn't suffer. Binds don't want us to lose that. Do you think it would be better to speak to our biggest customers individually? I think that'd be a good idea, actually, before we announce it to the world. Exactly. So we won't send out a press release until we've spoken to our biggest customers. Then. Exactly.